You are running advertising and it simply doesn't work and leads are not signing up. There could be several reasons, but today I want to give you three reasons why your advertising may not work and how to fix it. What worked now today may not work tomorrow. And when we are talking about our message to market, that would be one reason why your advertising is not working. When you are running advertising and lead generation or no lead signing up, it could be a problem that your message to your market is off from the people receiving your message. They don't understand what you want from them or they don't have the desire what you are offering them. So you want to make sure, let's say you are talking to a young generation, first time home buyers, you want to make sure that you talk their language and that you convey how you can help them to buy their first home. That should be the message you are putting out instead of putting general messaging out where now people are getting confused if you are talking to a first time home home buyer, to a retiree, to an investor. So make sure that your message is the right message for your market. When you started to copy and paste other people's advertising, they may not work for you because you need to do some research so that you can put the right message in front of your audience. That means that you need to understand their wants and needs. So this is why copied advertising is not working because you are talking to a different persona to different kind of people than your competition and that is probably why your message is not reaching your market that brings me to the next um, uh, a reason why your market um, or your advertising is not working because you are targeting the wrong audience. That could be you are talking to people who never heard of you or you are not talking to warm people that most likely will sign up as a lead. So when we are running advertising, we make sure that we distinctive our cold audience, meaning people never heard of us, people never know, don't know who we are, so they never interacted with us. When we are talking about warm audiences, now we are talking about people that somehow interacted with us, interacted with our content, saw our video, and now I could put them in different audience buckets. Why I do want to do this? Because when you don't have people signing up as a lead, that could be the reason you are talking to a cold audience who never heard, so they are not interested to give you their name, number, and email. But when you have the right interpretation for you, what is a lead, you maybe have a different approach. For me, a lead is somebody who interacted with my content who saw my videos, even so I don't have their information, but I make sure that I stay in front of that audience and now building up and follow up with content that may interest them. So when you want to do lead generation, what we are recommending and doing in our business, we are doing lead generation to a warm audience, people that already know who we are and what we do. So that is why important you want to understand what is the interpretation for you of a lead and the approaches you are taking. And that brings me to my third reason, even if I don't have people's name, number, and email, and meaning they are a lead for me, now I have follow-up systems in place. We see with many of our students, they have no follow-up systems in place, even if they are just building their audiences, you need follow system, follow up systems in place. So when somebody watched one of our videos, we have a new video we want to show them because now depending how much they saw of our videos, now we can put different content in front of them and bringing them 
to a point where we are asking them for their name, number, and email so that I can get them in our personalized follow assist follow-up system, email, text messaging, messenger marketing. So there are different approaches. We know that people now take much, much longer before they even recognize who we are. So we want to make sure that we at least stay in front of them 36 times so that they get to know us, what we are doing, why we are doing what we do and how we do it. And that helps us to be more successful with our advertising and with our lead generation. If your ads are not working, here are the reasons. It could be your message to your market, the targeting is off your warm or your cold audience, or you don't have follow-up systems in place, even if you don't have people's name, number, and email, but they interacted with your content on social media. Want more tips and tricks like this? Follow my page, like this video, share with other people so that we can help more real estate agents building yeah, their business uh, using social media so they can win the hearts and minds of their people in their community.